I see these two Chef Patrices now chopping some carrots and celery. Some venom on that board too. That Patrice is a, a slicing and dicing machine. We should just call him patrice matic Poaching an egg? Oh, you gotta say, oh, of course I know how to poach an egg. It's pretty easy. I do that every morning. Yeah. The question is, do you do it right and nice and beautiful? You're on the right side. I'm gonna show you exactly how you poach an egg perfectly. All right. All right. First thing you gotta do is first of all setting up yourself. Right. Let me show you something in here quickly and very important. Here's the part. I don't know, it's not a good looking pot, but it can do the job for now. Here's my water in here. If I crack an egg and put it in there, what do you think is going to happen? The egg's going to go and fall on the bottom. The white's going to start spraying every, or everywhere. And then when you put the egg on the plate, you see the yolks, you see the white on the side. Doesn't look pretty, isn't it? All right. You don't want this. I don't want that either. Hold on a second. Let me go ahead and show you the first thing that you have to do is grab yourself a deeper pot, even with two hands, that'll be great, all right? Lots of water, good, huh? Now we're gonna drop this egg, and when we drop the eggs, what happens is the egg yolk is heavier than the egg white, so what's gonna happen when you drop it, the egg yolks, it's gonna fall on the bottom, and the egg whites, it's gonna come up like that, and it's going to run up and surround the egg yolk and make it look beautiful. That was easy, right? What do you put in the water? Now you're gonna need a little bit of, um, of vinegar, something acid. Again, what is it gonna do? It's gonna help the whites, uh, you know, to coagulate a little bit instead of spreading. Also a little bit of salt. Very important, right? Eggs need to be seasoned. All right, you got that? Let's put this in practice. All right, so the first thing also, of course, always get your eggs out of the refrigerator before you need to poach them, probably 10, 20 minutes. This will come back to room temperature. I've got in here some boiling water. I've got some salt. Let's go ahead and put some salt first, okay? There we go, a little bit of salt, it's fun. Now I'm gonna go ahead and put some vinegar. I'm, I choose to use white vinegar. This way the eggs doesn't get uh, tainted with the red uh, vinegar. But again, if you don't have any, you have red vinegar, a couple of drops, it's fun. So I'm going to go ahead in here and put a little bit of vinegar like that. Oops, a couple of drops, I said. <laughs> there we go. Now, the water boiling, it could be a problem. The air is going to separate and move around. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn it down a little bit and I'm going to be where, where the water is about to boil, but, you know, simmering or in the twilight zone, I call it, right there when it's about to boil, okay? So I'm going to turn this down a little bit and I'm going to go ahead and put the eggs all in once and See what's gonna happen. I'm gonna move that on the side a little bit because if it's boiling, it's gonna break. All right, there we go. And you can see right now the yolks is actually uh, surrounded the egg. There we go. How long does it take to poach an egg? Well, uh, myself, I like to have the white completely cooked um, and the yolk actually start to cook just a little bit. So this way, when you when you cut the eggs, it doesn't all come out like that. Um, it's up to you. I mean, if you like to have the white a little more running, just, you know, leave it less. How many minutes? Well, until it's done. Let me see here. I'm going to start to move a little bit. What I do is, you know, I'm going to take it out of the water and touch it with my finger. And I want to feel um, uh, not too soft. Uh, again, you might poach an egg and you undercook it. Now you know what to do for the next, po next poach eggs. Maybe cook a little bit longer until you really get the feel for it. All right. Uh, all right. Let's check this guy out. Um, I'm going to delicately take it out, all right, very nice. I'm going to fill it, I think this is perfect. So let's go ahead and put that in the plate. There we go. And I want to show you, I want to show you here how, how perfect this egg is. And you can see the yolks is completely su uh, surrounded by the egg whites, it's completely cooked. If you wanted to make it look even a little bit better, maybe you can cut the excess of white. I would do that when I do um, uh, eggs benedict. Just to put this on the muffin like this, this is pretty, guys. Uh, look at that. This is a perfect poached eggs, all right? Okay, so listen, don't forget to subscribe. And if you have any comments or any, any, any technique that you want me to show you, just, you know, write it on the comments and I'd be glad to uh, cut a video for this one, all right? And also, don't forget to check my website, chefpatrice.tv, all right, guys? Got some pretty good culinary noggins. The Patrice Amatic. That Patrice is a, a slicing and dicing machine.